Thank you for checking out my sweet and short demo of Clio. I am Errol Janis, owner of Edward Technology, and we provide IT support, cybersecurity, and Microsoft 365 cloud services to law offices all over America. We have two office locations in the Chicagoland suburbs, and my full contact information can be found below. Anytime you log into Clio, as you can see, you're going to be looking at your personal dashboard. This dashboard will be different for everyone in the firm, so if there are multiple members in your firm, everyone's going to have their own tasks showing here, their own calendar events, draft bills, bills, waiting payment, stuff like that, and it's going to be based on who the matter is assigned to, and I'll show you that part here in a second as well. You can also go into a global firm dashboard view. This is pretty new. Um, you're not really going to see much here because I don't have anything I'm really going on, so you'll see that. And then you go into the firm feed, so the firm feed just shows you what are the most recent activities and things that have been put into Clio. So this is cool for managing and stuff like that. Now if you look on the left here and on this menu column, you have your calendar. So there's a couple of different calendars that you can integrate into Clio. They're going to color code it for you as well. So it's easy to look at and identify what's going on. You have your tasks. So if you're using iCal or Outlook or something like that for your tasks, you can easily integrate that here into Clio. If you're not using anything for tasks, then this is a great way to get organized as well because you will get notifications that pop up while you're inside of the service. So that's pretty cool. Matters are pretty self-explanatory. This is where all of your matters will be. You can edit them and go into Quick Bill and you can also search here based on name, keyword, and you can also filter it based on the status as well. Now next you have your contacts, so this is where all of your contacts will be. And for example, this one says client because there's a matter associated with this one. Does not because I have not created a matter for this particular client. And then you have activities. This is where all of the activities that you're completing are going to go right here. And then of course we have bills, and this is what everyone is most interested in. This is what really draws people into Clio, is the ability to quickly be able to get bills out to clients so that payment can come in that much faster and just make the overall process that much smoother. It really, for us, eliminated a lot of lag time and delay as far as getting our bills out, which our clients appreciated as well. So this is pretty cool when it comes to billing. You can press this play button here, and this is a timer, and it's going to go ahead and time you. And whenever you finished with whatever you're doing, you go ahead and you stop the timer, and it's going to give you this nice pop-up. And the cool thing is that you can go ahead and put this in an activity category. Now, I don't have any uh, categories because this is a dummy account, but you will. So you'll put your activity category there. You'll put in a brief description. You will assign it to a matter. I'll go ahead and use the test uh, matter that I have there. You have the date, and then you have your rate as well. So boom, you save the entry, and now it's right into your bill. Now in the event that you're going to do a bulk kind of billing, then what you would just do is click on the matter, and this is going to take you to the matter, and you'll see kind of a nice little overview here of what's going on. You can go into the bill section, and it gives you kind of that individualized look as far as we're waiting payment, we're pending approval, we've been paid, we're in a draft stage, etc. Okay, so you would just go back into your activities here, and this is where you would put in your new time entries. So again, you click on the matter, you click on activities, and this is where you put in your time entries for your bill, and those is where you actually view the bill. So that is a brief example of Clio. You can see it has some pretty robust features and a very powerful billing platform, and we all know how important billing is. For any additional software or general IT questions, my full contact info is located below. Thank you.